Right, welcome back everyone. So today we're going to be making a recipe, so I'm going to be showing you how to operate this machine. So um, we're just going to make a very simple rapid white loaf. Um, so, you know, just going to show you the ingredients. So you just need some bread flour, butter, sugar, water, salt and some yeast, um, as it says over here. Um, and then you sort of just follow the instructions. Um, so I'm just going to quickly measure things and put everything in the pot. Okay, so I put all the ingredients apart from the yeast in the pan. So we're just now going to put the pan inside the machine now. So once you grow it in the pan, just make sure it's locked. So you just need to turn it and lift it up just to make sure. And then put that there. Then you drop this down and then you lift this piece up. And this is where we'll just dash the yeast in. Um, so yeah. The yeast is here now, um, and then all you need to do is obviously just check here, so you can see it says menu 2, um, so just make sure that's on 2 by just clicking on here, and then um, you need to select the size, um, so again, I put ingredients for medium, so just make sure that's M, um, which you can see over here, and then you can just adjust the crust, um, so I think medium's fine for me. Um, and then you'll just turn this down. That's all good. And then you'll click on start. And then, yeah, we'll come back after an hour and 55 and show you how the bread is. Right, so the bread's done now. You can hear that beeping noise and you can see the time is gone and it's showing this dash mark and then this light's also on. So what we need to do is make sure we switch the machine off and then make sure you have an oven glove. Um, it's gonna be very hot, so be very careful. Um, so just put the oven glove on and open it. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna get the bread out um, by tilting it, shaking it, and bring it in the plate. So there we go, that's the bread done. Um, not too bad, not for the first time. Um, we're just going to have to let it cool down, um, you don't want to cut it straight away, so give it a few hours to cool down, sort of an hour, two hour maybe, and then you want to slice it.